What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to uh, make and code a uh, progress bar in Visual Studio 2010. Um, you want to start off by clicking File, uh, New, Project. Make it a Windows Form application and I'll name it Progress Bar. Wow, my computer's really lagging right now. Wow. Okay, uh, you want to change the text for Form 1 to uh, really whatever you want, but I'm going to name mine Progress Bar because it's a Progress Bar test. You're going to need two things, or a few things, but uh, you're, you're going to need two buttons. Uh, click on the button, press Control C, and then click, press Control V, and it will paste a new one looking that looks exactly like it. First button, I'm going to go ahead and name it Start, not Tart. Start, and for button two, I'm going to name it stop. Now you're going to need to drag over a progress bar. As well as a timer. So drag over a timer. Um, double click on the start button uh, to view the code and then type in timer one dot start parenthesis parenthesis or whatever um, for stop you want to double click stop the stop button type in timer one dot stop and then the parenthesis stuff and then um, you want to go back to your form and then double click on timer one in the bottom left and then type in progress bar the component one dot increment and then uh, inside the parentheses you want to add a plus one now um, depending on the speed that you want your progress bar to go you can make this plus one to plus one hundred um, I'm going to make it I want it a little bit faster than one so I'm gonna put it at a two and then um, from here you can press F5 and debug and there you go progress bar coded very simply um, in Visual Basic 2010. Um, I'm going to go ahead and add another button um, and make this one close. Double click on the button and then um, the code for a close button is exactly the um, name for the close button so just type in close and then the parenthesis and then that's simply it and then let's debug start the progress bar works the stop button works and the close button works so there you go that is how you make a uh, progress bar for if you want to put it in like a fake virus scan or something and you want to click on scan instead of it being start just rename it scan and then the progress bar will go and um so thanks for watching uh, hope you can make something out of this. Uh, I didn't really have much use for it. Um, but thanks for watching. Uh, like it, subscribe, whatever. Uh, help me get views. Um, thanks.